First mover Americas, Bitcoin ticks along above $34,000. The latest price moves in crypto markets and context for October 30, 2023. This article originally appeared in First Mover, Coindesk's daily newsletter putting the latest moves in crypto markets in context. Subscribe to get it in your inbox every day. Latest prices, top stories, Bitcoin BTC has started the week in the same buoyant mood that saw it gain around 15% last week. The world's largest cryptocurrency has held steady above $34,000 in Asian and European trading hours, sitting at just over $34,500, up about 1% in the last 24 hours. The Coindesk Market Index CMI, a broad-based tracker of hundreds of tokens, is up around 1.4% on the day and over 11% in the past week. The crypto market's upward trajectory has been carried by enthusiasm at the prospect of a BTC spot ETF finally being approved in the U.S., though this week eyes may turn to the Fed's interest rate decision. While a pause seems the most likely scenario, with cuts seemingly still a while away, crypto watchers will no doubt be seeing this as another pivotal milestone as the crypto winner continues to thaw. Simon Peters, a markets analyst at eToro, wrote in an email bulletin. Should crypto's rally hold firm against a neutral Fed announcement, it could be a sign of further thawing and increased resilience in digital assets. The Chicago Mercantile Exchange CME is now the second largest Bitcoin futures exchange with only Binance holding a greater market share, according to data from Coinglass. Notional Open Interest OI the value locked in the number of active or open contracts on CME reached $3.54 billion compared with Binance's $3.83 billion. Open interest in CME's cash settled futures contracts surpass 100,000 BTC for the first time, and the exchange's share in the BTC futures market rose to a lifetime high of 25%. The ascent of a regulated, mainstream financial exchange is a sign for some observers that the recent rally in the crypto market is institutionally led. Thai bank Casicorn, also known as K-Bank, said it has acquired a 97% stake in crypto exchange sating at a valuation of 3.705 billion Thai bought $102.8 million a month after the creation of its $100 million fund targeting Web3 and fintech investments. Following the closure of the deal, sating will be rebranded to Orbix along with three new subsidiaries, Orbix Custodian, Fund Manager Orbix Invest and Blockchain Tech Developer Orbix Technology. K-Bank rival Siam Commercial Bank has also been targeting inroads into the digital asset industry, last month inking a partnership with Hashed, one of Thailand's biggest Web3 investors. Chart of the day, the year-on-year -year percentage change in the U.S. Consumer price index from 2013 to date looks eerily similar to the 1,900 70 seconds. If history is a guide, inflation may rebound in the coming months, boosting demand for perceived store value assets. Bitcoin, widely considered digital gold, is set to undergo its fourth mining reward having in April next year. Reward halvings have historically presaged major bull runs. Source, Game of Trades Ankar God Bull, Trending Posts. Sam Bankman Fried implied his friends lied about his role in FTX's collapse Singapore, Japan, UK. Swiss regulators plan asset tokenization pilots crypto exchange linked to three AC founders drops lawsuit against Mike Dudas.